Hey yo, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for being here and checking out another video. Hey, if you're new, hit subscribe. And even if you've watched some other videos and haven't subscribed yet, go ahead, hit subscribe, hit that bell notification. That way when new videos come out, you get notified. Um, really working to get videos out every week. Lots of excitement about the Tacoma. Obviously, it's the number one selling mid-sized truck in America and for good reason. Uh, my videos cover a lot of why the Tacoma is so great and therefore why it's the number one selling mid-sized truck in America. So hey, in this video, I want to uh, do a little bit of a deep dive into the bed, uh, the short bed specifically of the Tacoma. All right, let's get into it. So in this video, I want to do a deep dive into the truck bed, the short bed of this Tacoma. I know that there's a lot of people that are buying Tacomas that are having to buy them sight unseen. You know, by the time the truck hits the dealership lot, usually someone's already got their name on that. And so you really can't wait until you get a, a lot full of them. You're having to order it in advance, having to put down a deposit, maybe something like that. And this way, you know, even if you don't have a chance to maybe test drive it before or go check it out, hopefully this video can give you a little bit of an overview of what's in the TRD off-road and the TRD Sport. I know is similar, if not exactly the same. It is a beautiful fall day, leaves are changing color. Uh, just drove up the canyon a little bit. Again, want to talk a little bit about the Toyota Tacoma short bed specifically. Now, as you can see, I've got the tonneau cover on. This is the Tiger tonneau cover. Let's go ahead and roll that up and then we'll jump into the details here. All right, I was able to roll up that tonneau cover one-handed, not too bad for holding a camera and rolling it up at the same time. Now I did opt for the roll-up cover because it's a short bed and, and that's why I'm bringing it up, but because it's a short bed, I didn't want the trifold that was always gonna take up a third of the bed. Now I know there are some that actually fold all the way up and then it blocks that back window. I didn't want that either. So that's why I went with the roll-up cover. As mentioned, this is the short bed. I'll kind of back out a little bit here. So this is the short bed, it's a five and a half foot. I'll put the, the specs on screen here specifically, but you know, it's a good size bed if you're gonna be hauling stuff. I mentioned this in another video, I've been able to put some like uh, six and eight foot boards in it. Six foot boards on an angler are gonna fit no problem. Eight fit are obviously gonna pop out, still easy to haul, easy to carry. All right, so as you saw, this does have that dampener on it. It's really nice how that drops down. It's not going to clunk down, not going to land on something hard. That dampener really lays it down really soft. Now I do have the OEM truck bed in here, but the bed itself is a composite bed all the way around. So this is not an inlay. This is the actual bed itself is a composite bed as you can see. Now the material there, same as the back here, it is that hard composite material. The uh, slats on it run this way, so they're running kind of front and back. I did drop on the OEM mat. I actually really like the OEM mat. I'll link to my other video talking about the OEM mat and why I think it's a must have mod for your Tacoma. Um, but even with the mat on, you know, it really is going to leave open everything you need to as far as hooks and tie downs. Hey, just a quick reminder, go ahead and hit subscribe. Let's get some more subscribers, get some more followers, keep kicking out a, a weekly video talking about Tacoma's adventures. Got some uh, stuff I'm gonna do in the garage, got some mods coming up, all that kind of stuff, hit subscribe. All right, so looking on this uh, rear passenger side, uh, you've, got, you've got two things here. Basically, you've got some storage right there and then you have your outlet. Your outlet's just gonna be controlled up in the front, so you can turn that on or off. It's kind of a nice little storage. I don't have anything in there right now. The, the interior actually has a pretty fair amount of storage, so that's not something I found that I've needed. 
you'll notice you've got some D-rings here, so you've got some tie down spots here. And then if you follow the channel down here, you've got a hook there and you've got a hook there. So you've already got four built in spots to be able to tie things down. And obviously if you're hauling stuff, that's gonna be one of the main you know, advantages of that. Then the other thing you've got is this channel right here. Now I've got my tonneau cover hooked in. That's how the tiger cover hooks in. These uh, rails are on both sides and you can tie things into those as well. So with my Tacoma also came four of these clamps. These are gonna go right into this side railing right here. Those are gonna lock into place and then they provide you another hook point. There's four of them that came with mine. So that's gonna give you four more spots that you can tie things in. As you'll notice, once you get that in, that's gonna slide back and forth. You gotta kind of push that in, it'll slide back and forth, and then you're gonna be able to just tighten that down just like that. And that'll hook on all four sides all around the truck. So another thing to be aware of is obviously gonna be the wheel wells on both sides. Um, it does take up space in the back of the bed. So, you know, when you're, when you're carrying things, you gotta think about this is your width, not necessarily this outside edge. We were grabbing a couch, hauling it the other day for somebody. And, you know, we weren't worried about this part right here, but that's where it was kind of a snug fit. So you're gonna to have to take that into account as well. All right, that is an overview of the Tacoma TRD short bed. I actually think that the SR5 is very similar. Uh, maybe a couple of differences would really probably only be the extra little storage that's there in the back and maybe the outlet. Uh, that may not be standard. I'm sure on the TRD Pro they are. So just a quick video today covering the short bed. Again, this is the TRD off-road, the off-road and the sport. Um, are pretty much identical. Now, mine did come with the uh, bed lights. Uh, those were factory installed. Uh, the, newer, the newer Tacomas actually have the cutout already in there and they're pre-wired. So you're just popping it out, lifting the light out on the side and then plugging it in. It's, it's um, from what I understand, a really easy plug and play solution. I love the bed lights. Um, you've also got the light on the back that comes standard obviously with that LED. But just to give you an overview of kind of the, the composite type of material, the size, you know, those tracks on the side allow you a lot of flexibility in being able to put in those extra hooks and be able to lock things down and tie things down. I've got the tonneau cover that is is in those channels. That's what's helping it secure it so that it is locked onto the truck. Um, you know, you can get a bigger bed, the long bed, if you're looking to haul stuff. The nice thing about the short bed is it keeps the truck just a little bit more compact, more mid-size, a lot easier to maneuver because of that. So hopefully this is helpful. If it is, uh, go ahead and hit a like on this video. That helps the channel a ton. Hit subscribe and we'll catch you in the next video. All right, peace out.